All right, Halos, welcome back. Uh, we are back in Atomic Heart once again on the final day of the it being available on PC Game Pass. As of right now. Ooh, can I get a secret? Can I get a sneak attack on this guy? Please? Yes. Yes. Oh, cute. Okay. Okay, exploded. Wasn't expecting that, to be honest. Oh, God. Is there another one? Yeah, there is. Did you guys see? think it benefits us to take him out, but maybe. You know, it might actually, because um, I can probably get like biological food or something. I don't know. Can I? Chemistry. I don't know. Maybe not. Uh, is there anything out here? Oh, I can't go across here, can I? Is that going to hurt me? It's probably gonna hurt me if I walk through it. I don't, I don't think it's worth risking. I knew it. I was like, there's probably a, a guy hidden in there. Alright, anyways, um, let's continue to be careful if we can. Do have the cows and all that. Does that give us anything? No, I don't think so. Maybe the cows would, but I'm not really sure to be honest. Oh, there's something in this building though, it looks like. Can we get in? Maybe th th through the front. Aha. Uh -huh. nice. Some radio playing something or other as well. Alright, I think that's it. I don't want to get copyright struck, so I'm going to try to get out of there as quickly as possible. A, a Pichella. I guess let's try to get in there, probably. I think I passed the other one earlier, or maybe this is the same one. I think I passed it earlier, though. Alright. Um... You want up there? Oh, okay. He sees me. You're serving with you, Major P3. Unfortunately, you are about to be killed. She yeah, I'm about to be, aren't I? It's because that thing is going to send reinforcements. 
dang it. That's not what I wanted. Can't go through there, can I? No. Here they come. I thought for sure it would have been more. But okay. I'm down. How do I get up there? Is there a way? Oh, you can climb the pole, can't you? Nice. Okay. Oh, maybe not. Can I not climb the pole? Oh, it's an elevator. Okay, that's even better. I'm gonna crash just in case some random person sees me. Okay, can we shut this off then? Will okay, this, this device off. allow us to hack into the security system? Hacking into the system would be tricky. How do we... Oh, Access we denied. Please provide a valid code. Where's the fire, Sonny? Granny? Is that you? So you haven't forgotten old Granny Xena, huh? Good <laughs> for you. How's the Vavilov complex treating you? You like the cute little bush they got there? That cute little bush almost killed me. I barely made it out in one piece. And now I'm stuck here with this lousy piece of shit, Valon. Here's a little tip for you, Sonny. You need bigger guns. Then you can take out all those nasty buggers without breaking a sweat. Right. Guns are kind of hard to find around here. You should stop by my hut. I'll find you a blueprint. And it'll help okay. you back into that, Valon. I've got some codes for it around here someplace. Your... Hut? What kind of Baba Yaga would I be without a hut on chicken legs? <laughs> they broke the mold when they made you, Granny. All right, I'll come to your hut. Where is it? See the field on the hill? Down the road from that tower of yours. Head that way and wait for me there. I won't be long. Oh, okay. Gotcha. All right, so I guess I can't activate this stuff? All right, let's go, I guess. I guess I can't activate it right now. Sad. That would have been really useful. Can't just like zap it or hit it or something. And it'll deactivate everything around. That'd be great. Guess not though. All right, let's head down that way then. I'm assuming I can go through here now. Yep. Okay, the doors are open. Good. Already, yeah, already looted him. I thought so. Got a little kite or something going on over there. Look at that. Supposed to be like the Soviet star or something. Uh, let me check out the place around real fast. There's probably loot in here, I'm assuming. Oops. Right? No? Oh, maybe not. Maybe not. That's okay. Got a welding uh, mask there. Some sunflowers. What the heck? Oh, I think it's just ground. Looks kind of weird. Um, Alright, let's just go where, should they, where it takes us. Where it's leading us, right, basically. Is this a bell? Oh. Is it soap or something? Hello. Hello. Oh, what the heck? Did she send that over here? Let me go, you son of a bitch! That fucking bot almost killed me. That's pretty cool. I'll take one of those. It's like a portable cabin. <laughs> Sign well, me up. I'm here now, Sonny. Thanks for the assist, Granny yeah, Zena. It. So, where are these big guns of yours? I'm gonna need them. Come on in. Have a cup of tea. Cinematic. The heck is that? Kettle's there. Help yourself. Uh, okay. Nice TV. What's on? Cartoons. Have a seat and watch. 
What the hell are you? <clears throat> Regarding Shush. the reports, your beloved Sachinov, sir. About I want you to watch closely. At facility 3826. The malfunction has already been corrected, Comrade Molotov. Everything's back to normal. There's nothing to worry corrected about. Corrected or not, our American friends are likely to find out about this outrageous incident. Do you realize what this could mean for us? An international scandal! Is that a I scream? am fully aware of Are it. you? Our atomic heart project My. is in jeopardy! My project. A this project is the I started before the beginning of that damn war. A project you all refused to acknowledge. How many millions of Soviet citizens died in that bloody meat grinder of a war? I swore that the world would never see its like again. Well, well. I'm glad to hear you still value human <laughs> life over your mechanical toys, Comrade Sechenov. But that does not change the fact that we are all slowly being suffocated by Western sanctions. Comrade Molotov, I value human life above all else, and the age of capitalist exploitation is coming to an end. Soon the Western working Comrade class Sechenov. will cast off the yoke of the oppressor. I understand my duty all too well, Comrade Molotov. The polymerization of the entire Soviet population. The launch of the collective neural network. Operation Atomic Heart. What duty are you referring to, Comrade Sechenov? Do you even realize that if the Americans find out that your robots can be switched to combat mode, I guarantee your project will be dead in the water. They're not going to find out. I repeat, the malfunction has been dealt with. Comrade Sechenov, some members of the Politburo may be willing to take you at your word as an honored member of the Academy of Sciences. But I'm afraid your word is just not enough for me. What's that supposed to mean? The Politburo has come to a decision. And I have been ordered to head a special commission investigating your malfunction. We will be at your facility later today. Do I make myself clear, Comrade Sechenov? Well, Comrade Molotov, if the party deems it necessary, then... Holy shit, Granny Zena. How the hell did you get it's access to this? It's a direct connection. I've got eyes and ears everywhere, sweet cheeks. Don't worry <laughs> about it, okay? It's none of your business. Besides, you've got work to do. Okay. Interesting. I've um, got a little present for you. It's in the corner. You know what to do with Volan codes, right? Yes. And take this blueprint. You can give it to my repair vendor. It won't bite. Unlike your girlfriend. <laughs> what? Girlfriend? <laughs> Thanks, lady. You're a real peach. All right. Um, assuming this is the only thing we need to get next. What is it exactly? Oh, blueprint. Right, so now we can build that weapon, the Dominator. Okay, um, let me check out what we can do for upgrades and stuff, and then uh, we'll see how we're Authorization. Today. Major Nichayev, codename P3, access granted. Let's upgrade our gloves first, I guess, see what we have in terms of polymer. A pretty good amount of neuropolymer, I mean. Um, Bounce to initial target, could hit one additional target. Okay. Yeah, this seems really nice actually. But let's see. Um, electrified targets received increased damage, increased the speed of shock charging. Okay, interesting. Character. Increased, increased resistance to physical damage. That would be really nice, yeah. Let's do that for sure. Uh, we already have the resistance to all that. Increase your maximum health, that's gonna be really nice too. Let's see, shields from all damage while, while dodging, that's actually really good too. Cell division. Using medical supplies, it supplies allows you to fully regenerate health in a matter of seconds. Okay, that's nice. 
Um, let's see, you can use a new med castle with one hand. That's nice, actually. Yeah, that's really good. Can't buy that yet, can I? No, yeah. I have to get this other one first. So let's get this. Let's get this. Increase your maximum health first, and then we'll should be able to unlock that next time around, I think. Um, so yeah. All right. Cool. That's gonna be all of that for now. Let's switch to crafting. Uh, let's see. What did we? She gave us the dominator thing, but we don't have enough stuff for it yet. So we could save up and try to get that. Uh, what is the PM? I have a lot of ammo for this. Makarov pistol or PM for sure is present for every Vostok Cosmonaut's equip equipment kit, which makes it the first fire firearm to have gone into space. Um, okay, is it automatic or I don't know? How much does it cost to make again? That's a lot of stuff actually. Um, Fox, what is this? Rest on the X button, type of ammo. Threatening message. Okay. Um, is it better than what I have though? That's my thing. Uh, let's see. It has three, uh, seven, three, seven, four, five, seven. What is our current one? Four. Doesn't it has faster attack speed? Slightly less range. And then the charge damage and charge speed are more. I think right. Two and five. Yeah, a lot better. Charge damage and charge speeder. Well, charge speed is seven on that one. And my charge speed is five. Yeah, charge damage, charge speeder are a lot higher. <laughs> Has slightly less range, but more attack speed. And slightly less damage, but I can upgrade that, I think. Um, it does cost a lot of stuff again, though. I don't know. Maybe I should wait and try to get, um, try to get this weapon. Dominator. It's a it's a electric ammo thing as well. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know, guys. I guess let's just upgrade our stuff probably for now. Um. Can I upgrade my blade for more damage? <coughs> no. What is this? Damage to organics. Can charge that a little bit quicker if I need to. Ooh, that would be nice. But we need a extra saw or something there. Um. Round attack, take less damage, increase energy bonus for spinning results in two hits. But it, it requires that stuff, so eh. Hmm. Grip. Increases energy bonus. Special attack. Increase elemental damage. Um Nah, that that doesn't seem worth it. <clears throat> Ooh, so, I didn't mean that completely. Be major? Go out weapons though. Or a Let's go back to weapons. Um, let me check out our two weapons here. See if we can get up any of the damage here. EMP generate edge the special attack, increase charge damage. Yeah, that's definitely. D oh, we, we don't have enough for that. Dang it. Need one more of that. Okay, never mind. Barrel increases damage. Yeah, there we go. Oh, I don't have enough stuff for it. Dang it. Ah, uh, everything costs so much. <laughs> Dang. Okay. Unlucky there. Uh, we already checked that. Let's check out this, I guess, as a last uh, last resort. Get a lot less recoil. Recoil. Um, if we decide to do that. Uh, what do we else do we have here? Muzzle break increases damage. Increases rate of fire and accuracy. Damage to robots. Okay. Yeah, I mean, this is nice, but I think this is a little better. <laughs> um, <clears throat> I guess I could try this. Seems nice. And then I do want to get this as well, but I don't think I have the stuff for it. Yeah, I need 12 of these bad boys, which are kind of hard to come by. Um, don't have enough for that. That would be nice too, but I don't have the right thing for that. And right, we already have that, so yeah, I think we're good there. Um, Alright, I guess that's going to be it for now. Uh, let's go ahead and save if we can. There's a save slot. It'll probably save when we leave. Um, either way. You're no ordinary old lady. Really? You seem a little mixed up, Sonny. <laughs> no kidding. 
You've got a flying hut, a quantum computer hanging from the ceiling. Of course I'm mixed up. I've never met anybody like you before. You've got a memory <laughs> like a sieve, haven't you? Well, I guess there's a few little things I can't remember since I got injured. But I definitely remember you. Little things, you say? Well, now you've got something really important to do, right? Pretty much. I need to get to the VDNH. Is there a train station around here? It's right past the village. Head down the road, you can't miss it. Just keep an eye on the sky. All right. Um... Yeah, we, we could talk to her for a while, but anyway, I'm just gonna go ahead and I head gotta out. run. Off you go, little pup. <clears throat> oh, I almost forgot. You didn't find a couple of rings down there, did you? Gold ones in a facility 3826 box? Rings in a box? No, Granny Xena, I didn't see anything like that. I was kind of busy. Well, off you go then. Enjoy the VDNH. Thanks. I really appreciate the help. Wait. So I guess I could have found something. You're down meeting there. Stockhausen there, aren't you? How the hell did you know about that? A little bird told me. Tell the Crouch things might have been different if he hadn't been chasing after another man's woman. <laughs> Whatever. I have no idea what you're talking about. Grab a car in the village. It's a long walk to the station. Alright, well. Sweet. That sounds good. Uh, Charles, who is this Granny Xena lady anyway? That's a difficult question to answer, Comrade Major. I've never met her. Yeah? I figured you knew her. Why is that? You didn't say a word when we were talking. I assumed you didn't want her to hear your voice. I decided not to reveal myself until I can determine exactly whose side she's on. Makes sense. So, what about this atomic heart project Dr. Sechenov was talking to Comrade Molotov about? I have no data about it. You'd have to ask Dr. Sechenov. Nah, it doesn't matter. The boss will tell me about it if I need to know. Let's go find a way to the station. All right. Um, thank you guys for watching. I'm gonna go ahead and end it here. I thought I could climb up there, but it doesn't look like it's gonna really want me to. Um, but yeah, <clears throat> let's go ahead and head out, and we'll catch you guys in the next video. Uh, thank you for watching once again, and see you there. Peace.